Howdy there, folks. This is Luke Charles Kuhn at Kuhn Truck and RV, your little RV specialist. Started by our mom and dad in 1976, we are proud to be a second-generation family-owned and operated business. My friends call me Luke and my sisters call me Charlie, but you can call me anytime at 440-OHIO-RVs. A member of our growing team would be happy to help you. Please check out our website at truckandrv.com to view all of our inventory. There's a direct link to this particular RV in the video description below. If you follow that link, it will take you to our website where you can see the pricing and information on this unit. Once this unit is sold, that link will be removed. The all-new Rovelite series by Travelite RV is designed to be affordable and extremely towable. All Rove Light campers are constructed with a honeycomb composite floor and aluminum chassis. All interior panels are Asdell composite, exterior walls are gel coat fiberglass, and the seamless poured resin fiberglass roof is one piece from bumper to hitch. Give us a call at 440-OHIO-RVs. Again, that's 440-OHIO-RVS. We are required to advertise the MSRP price for these. Call us for the best price anywhere on these new Rove Light campers. Alrighty, folks, here we are stepping up and into the all new Rove Light 14 FD from Travel Light RV. So, this is known as an FD because of this front dinette. Got a nice big counter space here in the rear. Got a screen window here. Do have a blind on that. Got your coach battery disconnect that turns on and off the coach battery to prevent parasitic draw. Got your fuse panel here. Got your TV hookups, so you can set your TV on this spot here if you'd like. Got 110 power. Got the control for the tankless water here. Got the levels test for the gray, black, fresh water as well as your coach battery. Water pump on and off. Thermostat to control the propane furnace. Nice little wet bath here, not too much of a step up and in. <clears throat> so you're going to do all your business here inside of this room. Got a little shelf in the back there for your goodies while you're showering. Exhaust fan overhead. Moving down to the kitchen area. Got about six foot of headroom in this unit. Got an air conditioner here that runs off of the shore power plug-in only. It's controlled via the knobs right there on the front. That's plugged into the 110 power right there in this compartment. Got a screen portion here. Drop that shade down or blind, whatever you want to call it. Single basin stainless sink. Two burner propane cooktop. Got a nice spot here for counter space for preparing your food. We've got storage beneath the sink. Got your furnace right there. This is a 12 volt refrigerator. Got a little freezer portion up top. Got a Noxus gas detector here. This table is on this tripod mount that allows you to use this inside and outside of the coach. It also eliminates the mount being on the floor where you can stub your toes. Got the fire escape here. We do have a prop rod so you can have that open. There's a screen on this window. Got the blind there for privacy. All these lights just click on and off on the lights themselves. Got a screened portion here, blind for privacy. Got some storage over top. Got your radio head unit here. This controls the speakers inside that are up under here and also outside. Got your power awning and porch light switch. Got a nice screen door as well. Again, about 60 inches of headroom in this unit. And we've got your smoke detector. We've got your fantastic fan here. This runs on the coach battery that can act like an attic fan at night. If you open the windows up, it'll bring the cool outside air in. The front dinette bed measures approximately 55 inches north-south or front to back and 74 inches east-west or side to side. The other part of the dinette measures approximately 54 and a half inches north-south and 23 inches east-west. There is storage beneath the dinette that can also be accessed from outside of the camper. The new Rove Light series is constructed with a honeycomb composite floor and aluminum chassis. All interior panels are Asdell composite, exterior walls are gel coat fiberglass, and the seamless poured resin fiberglass roof is one piece from bumper to hitch. Very limited wood materials are used, making these Rove Lights some of the most towable campers on the market. We will not be undersold on new Travel Light units and will beat or match anyone's pricing. Here we are sitting up in the front dinette. What did the ocean say to the beach? Nothing. It just waved. Got 110 power here, two USB plug-ins so you can plug your phone or things like that in while you're sleeping up here. So we got unique construction on these. We've got Asdell interior sidewalls, gel coat fiberglass exterior, one-piece poured resin fiberglass roof, aluminum chassis. Got nice hard surface flooring, keeps these to keep clean. Got a honeycomb composite subfloor underneath here. 
There's limited wood used in these, mostly just for the cabinetry inside. So that's part of what makes these so lightweight and makes them more impervious to water. Check out these new Rove lights at truckandrv.com. Coon Truck and RV, the best little RV dealer around since 1976 and home of the RV brothers. Alrighty, folks, we're gonna go around the outside of the all new Rove Light 14 FD from Travel Light RV. The box measures 14 feet and it's 16 and a half feet length in total. We've got a 110 inch power awning. We've got gel coat fiberglass exterior sidewalls, one piece fiberglass roof. It's a resin poured fiberglass roof. It's one piece from bumper to hitch. We've got an aluminum chassis. The interior walls are Asdell. We've got your coach batter here, propane tank. Got your stabilizers around the coach. This is pre-wired for solar, so if you take a portable solar panel along with you, you can just plug that in right there. Got the back of the tankless water heater. Got the fill for the onboard fresh water tank, city water connection. Got your cable TV coming in here, shore power cord. Got the back of the furnace. Don't sit things here or those can get melted if you were to sit those in front of that and have the furnace on. Got an outside shower here. It's nice for kids, pets. If you're at the beach, things like that. Keep the mess out of the camper. Got the AC coming out the side here. It's kind of nice having it come out the side. One less hole in the roof. We've got your sewer dumps here. So you'll pull the different levers there to let the sewer go, whether that's your black or your gray tank. You always do the black tank first and then the gray. Got your exhaust fan in the bathroom there. Toilet vent coming out the top. Power awning over here makes it really nice to set up camp. Just push the button, run the awning out. Got your outside speakers here. Those are controlled via the head unit inside. Got two 110 outlets here so you can plug things in beneath the awning. Got a nice big storage bay here. You can access this from inside underneath the dinette. Real nice ultra lightweight travel trailers here from Travel Light. Check these out at truckandrv.com.